let's have a look at binary to decimal conversion. So first of all, this is a binary number, which means that we only use the digits 0 and 1. And you can see it's a binary number because we have the 2 down here. Now, to convert this to decimal number, we have to look at each digit separately. So for example, this digit here needs to be multiplied by 2 raised to the power of 0. This digit needs to be multiplied by 2 raised to the power of 1. And this digit is multiplied by 2 to the power of 2. Now, after the decimal point, or actually it's a binary point in this case, this uh, digit will be multiplied by 2 to the negative 1, and this one by 2 to the negative 2. And a fast way of converting is to not write it down like this, but write it down like that. We have a 1 here, a 2, a 4. And down here we've got a half and a quarter. So when we convert this, we have a look at the first digit, which is 1, and we have to multiply it by 4. The next one is 0, multiplied by 2. The next one is 0, multiplied by 1. The next one is 1, multiplied by a half. And the last one is 1, multiplied by a quarter. Now, since we are multiplying by 0 in a couple of cases, there's no need to write this down. So in the next example, we won't write this down. But for this one, 1 times 4 is 4, plus 1 times a half is a half, plus 1 times a quarter is a quarter, and that will come to 4 point, well, a half is 0 0.5, a quarter is 0 0.25, so we get 4.75, and this is in decimal. So I will write down a 10, so it's very clear uh, which number system we're looking at. Okay, let's have a look at another example. We'll do the same as above, we'll write down what we have to multiply. So this digit is multiplied by 1, this by 2, this by 4, this by 8, this by 16, this by 32, this by 64, and this by 128. We do the same going to the right of the binary point. So what we get here is a half, a quarter, one eighth, one sixteenth, one thirty seconds, one over 64, and one over 128. All right, so if we multiply, we get 128 plus 64, and I will leave out anything that uh, multiplies by 0. Uh, we've got 16 here, we've got 4, we've got 1, and then we've got a half, we've got 1 8, we've got 1 over 32, and 1 over 128. Now, when the, you add all of this up, you should get something like 213.6640625, and this is base 10. So this is an accurate representation of this number in that was